Ah, oh, I'm stretching out. My arms are sore. I've been playing roguelikes for the past, like, four hours. and <sighs> All right. So I just alt-tabbed. Where is my mouse? There it is. Single player. Standard. Uh, let's see. I had a really good run with Yoji last time, but I think I'm going to play as Android. Haven't really played as Android since I... Nope. I haven't really played as Android since I kicked the shit out of the arena. And, yeah, there are characters that I haven't played... Uh, played with that often at all, but I feel like I, I should probably Oh, I don't know. I like keeping to the things I like. I was playing as Mishka way too often So I'll probably come back to Mishka at some point. So we've got we've got kind of the short short-range power combo here I prefer the drill cannon. but This is a pretty close second. I am not gonna be able to get that shit back Oh, well, let's see if I can Got it all right, what do you got for me? And it's the Scarab. Uh, well, never mind, we fall through the level, though that's a lot of TNT. Okay, that was terrifying for a second, and we get the knife. Wow, we're getting some heavy loot really early on. That's really nice. It's gonna make my life easier. That hurt, though. Should probably take it out of circulation. Bam, got it. I like this game. It's, I think my only thing with it is if it played just like Risk of Rain, I think I'd be happier with it, because the problem is you're just doing the same arena over and over and over again. But, that's okay. Well, let's just brutalize through things and hope our luck stays about the same. Now, this character, except for the sword, the hero sword, there's actually a benefit, you know, of course, to staying lower than X health. I'm just, well, I don't know. I'll definitely keep the little guys off of me, so that's a nice benefit. Let's leave. And we've got plenty of worms. Now, how are we doing? Hoping for the best. That's, that's really it. If I can get another jump here, I'm going to be super happy. I've also been playing too many other roguelikes, so the, the whole, like, how are we doing situation, especially, like, so early on, is complete nonsense. Oh, that's a big worm. I really don't want to be fighting him, but at least we got the crazy lightning going on. Uh, this is one of the reasons why I like Android, uh, despite the fact that I hate her appearance. I like how the nail gun actually just persists, the nail gun visual effect. That's cool. But, um, is he coming back or did he die? I think that worm's dead. And he's dead, Jim. He's dead. Alright, well, let's start digging a hole that we can kind of hang out in until all the enemies have successfully spawned. Now, are they going to jump and kill themselves? Well, those are those ones aren't, but uh, time to leave. And we are surrounded by uh, surrounded by terror, sort of, not really. Either way, death and destruction to a small degree. And please let me get the crate before I accidentally destroy the level. There we go. Now this gun is kind of bugged, and that kind of un or not this gun. Uh, this item is kind of bugged. It's kind of unfortunate because uh, well, that targeting line is really useful if you've got the drill cannon and the harpoon gun, and like two upgrades later. It, the line's just gone for whatever mysterious reason. Never could understand that one. Kind of a shame that I, if I, if I can, and I would love to, I would love to get that final character unlocked in this run. Just, just like uh, legit is saying. But uh, uh, well, either way, there's also the question of wonder do you ever sleep? And for those of you that don't get the reference from, uh, you know, that are watching this later on YouTube, I'm recording this at near on 4 a.m., which is pretty ridiculous. And if, if you guys watching this have school or work in the morning, you should probably go to bed. Uh, uh, luckily, I don't have a day job. Unluckily, I don't have a day job. This means I have like zero sleep schedule and the easiest time for me to stream is actually like super late at night. So I've just become largely nocturnal. It kind of fits me. I, I work really well after a certain hour of the night. Unlike a lot of people and like the rest of my family is who actually wakes up just after I go to bed, and sometimes there's a little bit of a conflict there, and it's not good for me. But I live, I live in my parents' basement uh, temporarily, and that's like not a per permanent thing. I'm not old enough that it's like too freaking weird, but uh, it means I pretty much have peace, quiet, and a place to hide out in, which is nice. Let's leave. What do we got over here? Just a silver box? I think so. Oh God. I completely forgot about the fact that I am, um, I'm on a nice level. That could have been real bad. Oh, either way. 
high trajectory, high, high velocity android. Let's just let the lightning and stuff keep shit off of us. Yeah, it works fairly well actually. Except for you, you're gonna be a problem. Sifford bounces me straight up to kill it. Perfect. You need to die. Thank you. Uh, but I also just don't sleep much. I don't really need to. I probably should more, but the problem is, like, if I sleep more than, like, six hours, I actually just don't stop sleeping. And I just sleep for, like, ten, and it gets really bad. Whereas if I sleep for, like, five to six hours, it's pretty much perfect for me. I should actually probably leave. There we go. Um... But, so, my sleep schedule is awful, and at some point, I'm probably going to have, like, a truly real job that I'm going to have to, you know, go to bed at a regular time. And that's probably going to drive me nuts. I'm not entirely sure how I'm going to stream at that point. But this is part of the reason why I'm hoping that I end up just as a professional YouTuber and I can just, I can just maintain my unhealthy sleep schedule for the rest of my life. That would be great. I feel like I talk about becoming a professional YouTuber too often, but I don't know. I'm getting there. I'm at a thousand subs. I'm feeling it. Also, I don't know. It'd just be cool. Pipe dreams and whatnot. I like talking about stuff like that. I'm gonna I'm gonna go back to these videos like five years later and be like, damn, I was like way too eager for this shit. Turns out that being a professional YouTuber is like the hardest thing ever and it's just like, well, I doubt that's gonna happen. But anyway, I just get the feeling I'm gonna get, go back when I am actually uh, doing well YouTube channel-wise, and it's just like, well, this is this is way too much exuberance and looking ahead, and you know, spoilers. It turned it turns out I got hired by like X company, so I had to drop YouTube entirely. I would hate that. I don't think I don't think I'd ever quit. That would just be too much. I don't think I'm gonna be able to make it up to that box. So there's that. Anyway, ah, I might. I just, yeah, I'm not going to make it, especially if the ceiling's falling, but we got three jumps here. I'm just really hoping we can actually get some serious damage boosts. Like, uh, the bigger bullets thing would be nice, scatter shot would be nice, and uh, double shovel would be amazing. Well, either way, I'm I'm kind of low on money. We haven't gotten any resplendent vials yet. Come on, come on. Death to you and death to not me, please. Thank you. Okay, there's one box. I can re retrieve that one later. And there's the other one. Beautiful. There's all the cash we need. And some more health. Actually, we're not going to be uh, doing a whole lot of lightning here. Oh, well. Not the end of the world. That's what guns and stuff is for. And we get another jump. Four jumps. Nice. I'm going to have to be careful here, because there's actually another box. It's hard to see. Got it. Got it. Perfect. And then the rest of the level explodes. Very convenient time to do so. Now, following the previous run, I think I'm actually going to... Oh, no, that's not the one we want. For a second, I thought it was. It's the same shape and actually uses the same sprite, just recolored. But, uh, man, I was really hoping I'd have the... I was really hoping I'd have the uh, volcanic orb. <laughs> uh, legit is suggesting I play... I go play a super crate box. Legit, were you there for that stream? Did you miss that? Did, did you miss the stream where I played Super Super Crate Box? You do realize I do not like that game. Oh, God. There you go. Oh, um, wow, that was ex exciting. And I need some cash. That's okay. I'll have plenty here. Heart of Belial. Perfect. Oh, time to leave. Time to leave. I'm just going to blow this up. I've got enough for the treasure chest. Good. Let's give me Phoenix Trail. More of that. Alright. Wait, this is body armor. Damn. I was really hoping that was going to be uh, more bullets. The, the scatter shot, but... Oh, well. Oh, man. I don't, I don't want to play Super Crate Box again. That game is hard. Not fun. Well, either way. I might do it at some point. I would. I, I think I'd rather play Nuclear Throne. That's, that's my thing. Because, like, Nuclear Throne is quite a lot of fun. And... That's actually one of those games I've been meaning to get, like, meaning to get back to. I think the problem is it runs into the same problem as, like, Vigante, where I'm just not that great at it. So I would prefer to play... Well, I'm decent at Vigante. It's just... Nuclear Throne, I think I'm just... Uh, okay, you're gonna be... 
pain in the ass, especially because all your segments hurt me. Oh well. I guess getting hurt by this guy isn't that big of a deal. Hello, come to Papa, come to me. That is so much cash. Come, 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 come. Yeah. All right, now we can afford a bunch of chests. We've been running into money issues here. That's been kind of embarrassing. Okay, time to leave, time to leave, time to leave. It's not even worth sticking around at that point. Would have loved the cash, but at the same time, living is nice. But, yeah. No, I will, I will need to, okay. I will need to get back to both. What the crap even happened over there? I don't even know. They were just taking a lot of progressive damage for mysterious reasons. No idea. But, oh, the minigun super crate box. I was confused. Yeah. I, I think it's just one of those where it's like, I would truly rather go play this game, go play nu Nuclear Throne, go play any number of things. And it also crashes every, like, ten seconds. At game, games that just don't run on my computer usually aren't worth playing. Actually, I would love to play Dark Souls again. I haven't played a Dark Souls game in a while. I think that would be kind of fun. Okay, jump over that because it's going to murder me. And I should be able to, yeah, get this box down. Gimme. Perfect. And we got we got chests of plenty and stuff, but uh, I don't know. So <laughs> Super crate box is fun. I think the problem is like after a certain point I get too good at the games I play. And so I stop being like super energetic about it. And so like I don't have freak out moments. Like in, in this game, I, I don't freak out anymore because I'm actually starting to get really good at it. So it's just like, well, I guess the experience has been diluted. And let's see if I can drop the key. On it. There we go. Let's just murder the rest of everything. The level's exploding. Eh. Doesn't surprise me that much. Uh, but yeah, I, I don't panic anymore. I think Nuclear Throne would be a better replacement to Super Crate Box purely because I still have quite a lot of panic moments in that game. Whereas this, this has become calculated. This I understand now. Which is a problem. Dark Souls I don't understand. Let's leave. I almost jumped straight into it. I almost pressed spacebar twice. That would have sucked. Oh, we have homing missiles. I, did, I forgot about that. Anyway. It's GTFO, sort of. Ah, sweet. Homesick shard. Still no sign of that molten orb, though. Like, the thing is, I want to I wanna unlock that, that last character that I haven't unlocked yet, but the problem is, the item I need to collect is rare. And it makes it hard. But I do think, I do think it would be a blast having that character, because unlike all the other ones, she doesn't jump. I don't even know if it's a she or a he, actually. I'm just thinking of Android. But, uh, you teleport to your cursor. I'm really looking forward to that one. I think it would be fun. Anyway, let's leave. Forgot I have to use the shovel to propel myself on the ice level, otherwise I don't move. Well, to be expected. But anyway, alright. Night, Bengal. Night, pretty much everybody. Pretty soon. Because I can't imagine most people are going to be up. Past 4 a.m. And truly, I don't really expect... Oh, damn. There goes that box. And we get the hero sword. Hey, we're actually full health. As Android. That's crazy. Uh, then again, I've been playing pretty conservatively here. And pretty well, too. Which is unfortunate, but that's okay. Let's just let's just keep running around. I think it's also one of those where I just... I, I After a certain point, I stop, I stop freaking out in general. And I just start thinking. Oh, well. I guess... Intelligence is the death of humor. Where's the reverse? I, that's not even a quote. What, what the hell am I trying to say? I'm trying to be prolific here, and it's not working. I'm not supposed to be prolific. I'm supposed to be like, ah, Rudy Tooty, gun and shooty. Dumb one-liner. Bad misphrase of a hello. Cluster of iron, there we go. Bigger bullets, and I do actually have the cash for that. Good, I was worried about that for just a second. Come on, give me money. Give me more money. I deserve it. And we get more bomb squad armor. Oh, the very least, we're not going to be taking a whole lot of damage on this run. I'd love to get the shields on top of this, but that's okay. Of course, there are, of course, there are other people here that are, uh, you know, in different time zones. It's just the few of us on the East Coast. This is ridiculously late and nobody should be <laughs> up this late ever. But, yeah, whatever. Let's just beat the tar out of things. Come on. Come to me. I want to fight you. I don't. I don't want you to hang out there and get eaten by the ceiling. But that's absolutely. It's going to happen. I, I want to kill you. Get it. Get it, Get over here. Come on. Get. 
I really wish there was a movement speed booster in this game, like the Red Whip or the uh, Goat Tough, because I just move so slowly. I think it exists, but I have yet to find it or unlock it. And I should probably look into doing so. Oh, either way. Let's, let's gather that. Let's, can I reach it from there? Nope, my shovel radius is just a little bit short. That's, oh, that's a lot of TNT. I should probably keep away from that. That is where the pain happens. Welcome to the pain train. Ah, here we go. Scatter shot. Nails a plenty. Wow, you lose a lot of health really quick if you're not careful here. Luckily, I'm fairly careful. Fairly. I didn't say truly careful. I just said fairly. But anyway, how, how are things going? Uh, unfortunately, this is one of those games where it's like super... Uh... Uh... This is one of those games where it's like super active all the time. There's zero downtime, so it's almost impossible to It's almost impossible for me to like focus on Twitch chat, which makes me really sad because I really enjoy being able to respond, but Man when everything is exploding around you it is impossible Anyway, yeah, we seriously haven't found a whole lot of respondent vials. I don't think I have a single one. Yeah, I don't Weird. We've got a lot of pylons of frost though, which is interesting I Generally, don't even remember getting that item. Or seeing what its effect does. Oh, it, it's when the enemies turn blue. The thing is, though, they're dead so fast, it doesn't matter. I'm, I don't know if it works on the bigger enemies. I truly don't know. I also think this would, game would be really cool, actually, if if each level, like, if, if it was completely seamless. I can see that being really cool as well. Alright, I'm probably going to have to panic and leave shortly because everything is going haywire around me and I love to stay and chat but uh well it's time to leave still no volcanic orbs though weird that's kind of unfortunate all right and okay that's a lot of TNT that's a lot of boxes and a uh, heart of Belial perfect I want I want more of those I kind of wish the ice wasn't like on every exposed structure that I ever you know open up so, like, every every time I, like, dig a new spot, there shouldn't be that much ice there, right? But it's just, it's rife with ice for whatever mysterious reason. Oh, well, either way, let's just beat our way through these things. We don't even do lightning damage. We're too healthy. It's crazy. And that TNT didn't, it just kind of trapped all these guys here. All right, well, it works for me. I'm not above a hidden cluster of dudes for me to farm. I should probably try and take out this eyeball... I'm not gonna make it. Just time for me to dig down. Diggy do! Let's go! How are we doing? And it's the mecha worm. Giga mech worm, actually. Not mecha worm. By the way, he's. He always confuses me when he's like paused there for whatever reason. I feel like I should be doing something. To, like get him to. Is he charging his laser? Does he have like a laser eyes? That's what's going on here? Or, or is that my effect? I have no idea. I've never seen him, like, truly stop like that, unless he's frozen. Is that... that might be what's going on. Oh, that was probably the easiest Giga Mech Worm I've ever fought. And, uh, well, we get more bullets. So we shoot three nails at once. And for some reason, that part of the level exploded. I know there's TNT over there, but uh, at the same time, let's grab me some stuff and get me the heck out of here. Perfect. Alright, so there is actually an item called the Wind Leaf that does give you a movement speed increase. I just have no idea where to get it. Uh, I assume it's got some kind of weird unlock conditions, but I've never, I, I've yet to, uh, holy shit. You're terrifyingly large. All right, come on, come on, come on, die. There we go. What do we have in this chest? More, more nails. Damn. We're gonna be just shitting nails at this point. And they're huge too. We've gotten several clusters. So, no volcanic though. No volcanic orbs. Would like some of those. Would also like some health. I've not found. Oh well, there we go. There's the. Oh, there's the health we needed, or wanted, or something. I don't even know. Also, these block guys, not the round ones, but the like squared off block guys, make me think they're. I should probably leave. Come on, let me just go. Let me just go. I'll just. Okay. Did not die. It just. Oh, okay. It just paused there as though I had died, and I got really freaked out. Hello, toxic flast. You were. Not there prior. Yeah, we would have loved to stick around and kill all those guys and gotten, you know, copious quantities of... Hello. Uh, copious quantities of experience, but at the same time, uh, well... Mm, at the same time, didn't want to die. I like living. 
think it's nice. Shit's exploding around me. Oh, that's that's what's going on. They're spawning on, inside me. Also, that's a shit ton of nails. They don't even look like nails at this point. They almost look like syringes, which is kind of cool in its own right, but uh, not exactly the look they were going for. I think the thing is the nails are like weird and squared off for whatever reason. Eh, can't complain too much. I like our homing, homing missiles. They make life easier. Let's grab all that shit. I want to kill this red guy if I can. And avoid that guy, because he can pop us up into the boss. Or, not the boss. Into the death pit of doom, destruction, and despair. Because I have yet to even find a single volcanic orb. So, uh, chances here, we're not going to we're not gonna unlock the new secret character this run. Which is a shame. But it happens. Let's just take out the spawners while we can. Go for the eyeballs. Get knocked around like some kind of, I don't know, party toy. And you guys need to die. Thank you. Luckily, they don't do that much damage anymore. Really, these enemies are only that threatening if the drill is super close by or we're, if we're in the arena. And, well, we're neither. Therefore, worlds are oyster. World oyster. Ours. Yes. Okay, time for me to leave. Probably could have stuck around. Didn't really see the, see the need one way or another. God, we've just shat, shat missiles. Or, nail. well, I guess we'll get that treasure chest on the next level. Whoops. Too much TNT, honestly. Like, who who lines a place with that much TNT? Ooh. Don't know. Oh, either way, these worms are concerning. They have a lot of health. Like, excessive amounts. Luckily, I have excessive amounts of damage. And I'm still full health. This is crazy. When, when have I ever been, like, this healthy? Actually, plenty of times. I've, I've definitely gotten a lot better at it. I remember all the, like, really wicked... Uh, kind of nonsense. Oh, okay, you look dangerous. Uh, I remember all of the nonsensical looking Mishka runs. With a fair amount of fondness. Come on, come on, die. Thank you, time for me to leave. But, uh, don't miss it too much. Sort of. It's kind of hard to tell. I'm, de I'm definitely planning on doing a Mishka run soon, considering I haven't done one in a very long time. Right, we don't have kickback on the nail gun. Buy everything and then stick to the skies where we, can, where we can fly all over the place and get more boxing gloves and stuff. No volcanic orbs though. That is starting to, to starting to rankle. I don't even know if that's a word. Ah, well, who cares? If it isn't, I made it up. And if it is, I claim it for the glory of the Wanderbot Empire? Freaking, I don't know. Whatever, I haven't thought this far ahead. World domination, or at least Dictionary-based domination is not exactly my forte here. Anyway, back to murder. Back to maybe not murder. I'm not exactly going to call it murder so much as just uh, victory. Yeah. Time to leave. This place is getting scary. Could have technically stuck around for the eyeball creature, but uh, don't care that much. Wow, this is... I'm not going to say panic-inducing, but it's definitely tighter than I'd like to be. Speaking of tight, holy crap. This is nuts. Hey, there's our first resplendent vial. I was wondering when that was going to happen. That big worm. Like, we don't have a whole lot of room to maneuver here. Which does concern things. So we also don't have a whole lot of base healing abilities, come to think of it. We just do so much damage, we really don't take much. Alright. Another resplendent vial. Alright, this is going to solve our non-existent money problems. Yay! The best! Oh, well. Uh, oh, the aiming laser disappears when I melee. Go figure. Except for that's not always true. Uh, sometimes it just disappears permanently. But right now, I, I, I guess it seems to be in that case. I wonder. Actually, I actually have no idea what the cause would that uh, be for that one. Nope. Probably could have jumped a little bit. Just fought that last worm. But that would be probably excessive and super dangerous. So. Oh, nope, 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 nope. Time to leave. Bye, level. This is going well. I just really want that volcanic orb. Actually, I think it would be really cool in this game if um, if they had effectively command mode, where every time you transition levels, you get to pick what all of those boxes you opened gave you, or like whatever the items gave you, because that would be really cool. Of course, it would totally let you cheese the, uh, the character unlocks, but uh, whatever, who cares, right? Right, I don't care. I just want to play as the last character. I want to have it. I want to have everything. Of course, I also have to figure out how to get the golden guns in this game because they do exist. I just don't know what they are or how to get them. You guys gonna come down here? Or am I just gonna? All right. Well, I should probably leave. So I'm not gonna kill them in time. Oh god. 
It's not letting me leave. Why is it not letting me leave? Why- what? Oh god. Why won't it let me leave? Sweet Jesus, that was a lot of items. But that was very confusing. That was very confusing and very, very annoying. I was digging down as hard as I could and it just did not want to.